I think that Dante wanted to silence Uncle Gabriel because he knows about the fraud that father committed to his brother. I'm just worried about Roxana. She just found out that Joaquin is her mom and she's having a hard time accepting things that's happening to her. Right, the poor Roxana. She's going through a very rough patch right now. What are you doing, ma'am? I was just checking if everything's in order because you always misplace most of Pilar's things. I'm sorry, ma'am, but I always see to it that everything is in order. Do I you mean go the next time you talk to me in that way? Or if I find anything not in order here, I'm going to kick you out of this house. I'm sorry? Why do you look so nervous? Well, you see, Dr. Elizalde told me that they already found a heart for... for Gianna's transplant. Ah! <sighs> he also told me that they're doing all the necessary tests for its compatibility with Gianna's blood samples, and Babine. they will just tell us in which hospital, and then he'll meet us. This is your fault! It's because of you and your stupid mistake! Okay, I admit. I admit I made a mistake. But I never thought that fate would oh, come please, in Oh, please, don't even talk about fate! I won't wait for the result of the DNA test. Okay? Because from now on, I don't want to hear anything from you. No. Pedro, I beg you. All I want is to apologize to Fiorella. You just have to be patient. Because if you'll ask me, Mr. Vittorio, anyone would go crazy if you keep a letter from them from their long-lost dead parents. But I know that she's going to forgive you. Because Fiorella has a big heart. The family who raised me was lovely. And they know how to be responsible parents, unlike the two of you. <laughs>